everybody welcome back to my channel today is all about the sephora mini haul i told you guys that i had gotten a gift card from my sister-in-law and i got the items in and i went ahead and pardon me with the tissues um i went ahead and decided that i would open it up today since i got to be close to home today and with all that said, let's go ahead and get started. If you are new to my channel, thank you for being here. Please click like if you like this video. And if you like others of my video, go ahead and watch them and like them. Share them. Subscribe if you want to see more. The thing about my videos is that I don't typically edit my videos very much, if at all. And the bloopers are real and they happen often <laughs> because I don't really have a set script. I just like to have fun. I'm just doing this because it's a video diary for me sort of and it's just a way for me to go over different things because I do a lot of reviews of products and because I'm doing reviews of products I kind of want to have like video references so I can go back and look at them later and I just thought it'd be fun to share them with everybody else. Some people seem to like them. If you like this kind of thing, stick around, pull up a chair. A lot coming for you today and every day. <laughs> Basically, I've always got a lot to say. So let me go ahead and get cracking with this Sephora haul. All right, so it's a mini haul. I got a $25 gift card and I went ahead and bought a couple of things. I had to spend $50 to get free shipping or even to use the card. I think it said on the card that you had to spend at least $50. So I did that. And I've always wanted to try Fenty Beauty. So I kind of focused on that. But before we get into the Fenty Beauty, I wanna show you what I got as samples. Now, the two little samples I got, mini samples, I got this Caudel Vinosource. It is a hydration, intense hydration. Figured I'd try that. And then I got a little teeny tiny dot of Tasha, the dewy skin cream. I used some points that I earned to get this little itty bitty container. This is the box it came in and it was just like wide freaking open. This little thing was just like kind of hanging out. But it's this teeny tiny little container of Tasha. I've always wanted to try it. It's they say it's really good for putting it on put it on before you put on your makeup. So I'm definitely gonna try that. And I've got a full face of makeup on today, and I just use the normal, which is my Pretty Fresh by uh, Pretty Fresh Hydrating Primer from ColourPop and Pretty Fresh. So let's go ahead. Those are the samples. We're done with that. Let's go ahead and get into what I actually got with my $25 dollars or fifty dollars basically i got this little diamond bomb baby it's a tiny little uh lip gloss and highlighter so i'm just gonna go ahead and crack it open because i haven't actually even opened this i just saw it i mean i opened the box and looked at what was in there we didn't really do much with it because i just wanted to save it to do it on the video because i like getting my real reactions in real time and not anything being fake Ooh, that, that packaging on the inside is really nice. It's like this pink, and it's kind of got like, it's like a baby pink, and it's got this velvety feel to it over the plastic. And then here is your little teeny tiny diamond highlighter. Let's see if I can pop that sucker open, as long as it's not sealed. And I don't drop. I dropped it. It popped open. Hopefully it's not broken see oh thank you makeup gods it's not broken <laughs> this is the highlighter let's go ahead and give her a little little bitty swatchy woo oh wow look at that finger now i don't ha i couldn't find my ring light I'm kind of in a hurry I had a crazy phone call before i left the office oh wow so pretty so we're just gonna do this in natural light, guys. I'm sorry, couldn't find my ring lights. And I do everything on my phone currently, so. <laughs> more fun, more fun. Um, next one we got here is the lip gloss. That's how she looks, cute little bottle. And let's get 
that open. Now, uh, my makeup today is very, I wanted to go like, like slightly glam. I used the Pure 3-in-1 or 4-in-1 concealer and foundation, and I like it. I used it with other products. I used it with Mascara Beauty products, and I'm liking how it's turned out. This is the lip gloss. Of course, it's a gloss, so it's not going to have like a lot of color, but it is pretty. I might just go ahead and throw it on top of what I'm wearing right now. Of course, when I eat, this will all come off, but for now, we got this pretty little color. It smells really good, and it feels really good. I can see why Tati Westbrook likes this so much, but yes. So now we got one, although this thing is so slippery. I keep dropping it like, oh my gosh, I've dropped it 50 times. <laughs> So I'm going to probably pop this in my, in my bag, take with me, um, back to the office. Am I going to stay? It's not saying that. Okay. So let's move on to the next item in this box. And this is the last item. Like I said, I only spent $50, so I didn't get a ton. But the second thing I got was this palette. It is a highlighter palette. It is called the Kilowatt Foil. I don't know if you can see that there. Kilowatt Foil. It's kind of got this... Uh, is it hollow? Where's Christine when you need her? I can't tell because I'm not a hollow expert, but I am definitely, I do definitely identify as hollow sexual. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. <sighs> so beautiful. That box is just gorgeous. Let's go ahead and pop open the palette. All right, she's in this little black over packaging. And there she is. Ooh, that even looks very rainbowy. All right, so this is how she looks, guys. Ooh, she is so pretty. Some pretty colors. Of course, you know that these probably will be used as eyeshadow for me, seeing as these colors are so dark and I am so pale. So let's go ahead and swatch them. Now, I've already done my makeup today, but I might add a couple little little spruces to it. So I'm going to just go ahead and pop a little bit of this burgundy color, which is called, whoops, where, can you see it? Honey Slope. And then below Honey Slope is the Coppin, Coppin Ice, because this is, this is sort of like a copper. That's Coppin Ice. Oh, she's so pretty. All right. And then next to Cop and Ice is Heartburn. This one here is Heartburn. Pop her on there. Very, very pretty. And then we've got next to Heartburn is Sub-Zero, which is this like blue-white shift one right here pop her next to that she's sheer and then next to that oops am I going the right direction next to Sub-Zero going up is Scandal Ice which is this pretty pretty purple one now this one is the one I'm not going to lie this is the one that I pretty much got the palette for I just love a pretty purple sparkly moment and there she is she's very sheer it's right on top of the other one I'm not that great at swatching <laughs> and then the next one up to that one is this blue here it's called chill Z I'm gonna do it with my thumb so I don't know that's probably not gonna come out that great but it makes a big fingerprint in there so I'm just gonna on my arm there you go. It is very much highlighters. So there's no mistaking with that. Now we've got this one in the middle, which is stone cold. And I'm going to try to get a clean finger so I can go into that one for you guys. All right. That's right here in the middle. Stone cold. And ta-da. She is beautiful. Now I'd like to play with them a little bit. I did not put on any highlight this morning on purpose because I knew that I was going to be home 
this afternoon from lunch because I knew it was going to be close by because I'm working at the office near the house. Got it off. It does come off. They are very soft feeling. I have not tried the eyeshadows yet and I wanted to get the eyeshadow palette, but when I went to check out, the eyeshadow palette was gone and it came back for a minute, but I didn't have money at the time. So I didn't get it and today is payday and I don't know that I would get it anyhow because I'm trying to control the spending and start using what I have. And the only reason I got it was because I had the $25 gift card. Otherwise, I wouldn't have got it anyhow. So we're going to go ahead and dip into the Stone Cold, which is the one in the middle. And we're going to do our little highlight for today. Since we've already done everything else. Ooh, she's so shiny. Do you see that? Now, this brush is uh, the best blend from Mascara Beauty. I'm just going to put a little up on here, too. And a little down the center of my nose here. And then I'm going to blend it with this best blend side here, which just kind of is like the coolest little blender ever. Let me tell you right now, Mascara Beauty has good brushes. I've not tried a whole lot of different brushes out there, but I've been very happy so far with everything I've tried from Mascara Beauty. I put a little highlighter up here under my nose just to highlight the Cupid's bow area. And then I'm going to put a little on my forehead because we love a good glow moment don't we ladies and gentlemen glow all day long glow to the heavens as nikki tutorial says <laughs> all right so that is that highlight and i don't even have my ring light today and it is just beautiful it's just beautiful you can still see it that's fantastic and because i'm wearing purple in this shirt that i'm wearing today I'm gonna go ahead and try to put a little bit of that purple on my eyeshadow. Now the, eye, the eyeshadow that I'm wearing today is Kathleen Lights. It is the So Jaded palette, which is one of the ones that I said I was gonna to try to use in the, the month of January 2020. Pop a little bit in on there, and it does it does adds like a little bit of oomph to it, I guess. It, I think it's really pretty. I might just try using an actual eyeshadow brush and playing around with it a little bit. I don't have one that is clean, but y'all, you know, your girl loves her eyeshadows and using all the colors in the world, but doesn't really get to clean her brushes as, like, as often as she'd like to. But I have brushes and I should be getting more in my box charms that I'm going to be having coming so stay tuned for that if you're like into um subscription box openings you'll really like that because I've got a lot of them coming up well boxy charm anyhow I don't know about a lot of them and I also have something from influencer coming influencer is a marketing company and they let you sample products before they come out to the public now, some of them I can't review, I can't review or reveal until a certain point in time, but they'll let me know which ones those are. I know for sure I'm getting one product. I don't know if I'm getting anything, anything else other than that, but I have one product that will be coming up and hopefully I'll get to do some sort of like review onto that. But yeah, so this is how this looks. I think it looks really good. I've got a pair of Kiss Magnetic Lashes on today. Well, they're Magnetic Liner and Lash Kit. But that's what I'm wearing today. And I've kind of got my hair down. I don't know. What do you guys think? Do I look, does it look too ratty to have it down? I absolutely love this top. This is one of the tops that I got from Zulily. It's got this high collar. But if you look at the back of it, it's got this cute little bow tie in the back. So I think that's really cute. Oh, the bow tie is like limped <laughs> and hanging goofy. But that's because I tied it myself. I didn't have anybody to help me. So yeah, that is that. And then of course I'm wearing some of the jeans that I told you guys that I liked so much. I got them in a different style, like a different color. It's just a lighter color, but you can see it's that three button thing. Oh, I missed the button. So, hey, I told you, I told you guys that the bloopers are real and they happen in real time. But yeah, I had a stressful day. I had a patient well, not stressful day, just a stressful call before I came here. The patient just was was uh, having some trouble getting onto his website and we just had to 
to work it out. And I think by the end of the call, we were both pretty happy. So that was my day. And I hope everybody else is having a fantastic Friday and has a wonderful weekend. I don't know if I'm going to post this today or if I'm going to wait until next week and post this because it just kind of depends on how my week is going sometimes to whether or not I want to post. And then I don't, I need to have things to talk about. I try to post regularly every two weeks. That's going to be my upload schedule. It's hopefully regular every two weeks and then surprise videos in between when Catrice's son has practice over in this area. But yeah, so that was my little mini Sephora haul. Hope you guys liked it and I appreciate you being here. I appreciate you coming back. I appreciate you liking my videos. So if you do like this video, I'm gonna say it again. I'm gonna reiterate it. Like it down below, cause that helps. That helps me show up whenever I post new videos. If you like videos like this, if you say that you like it, then you'll be recommended more videos like this in the future. And then mine can end up in recommended videos as well. So my friend, Sarah, well, her nickname's Izzy and she goes by Izzy. She has sent a lot of people my way and I'm very, very thankful to you, Sarah. We are going to do a um, collaboration. I couldn't think of the word. I was like, it starts with a C. We're gonna do a collaboration coming up soon and I'm super excited for that. And I wanna thank her for sending all the people she sent. All of her friends, thank you for subscribing. Please, you know, share, like, 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 like all you can. Comment down below. If there's something you'd like to see me do, if you think that there's something that I should try that is just right up my alley or just my style or something and you want to make recommendations below, please do that. I'm hoping to be able to do more in the future. Like, I think I could probably do a get ready with me in February. I have a, a hair appointment. And I'll probably just do my makeup as a get ready with me because I don't have to be at the appointment until nine. So maybe early that morning, I will go ahead and record my get ready process and share that with you all. That should be fun. And I'm trying to think of anything else I got going on besides all the things I've mentioned. But yeah, thank you so much for being here. I hope you guys enjoyed this and these little goodies. They have been the best little $25 goodies I've found. Well, $50, but it was half free. Like either this or this could have been the free one that I got as a gift from my sweet, adorable sister-in-law and I appreciate it. And I am gonna tell you guys what I think of the Tasha. Uh, that is something I've been wanting to try forever. It is expensive stuff, but I think I'm going to like it. It, it. it has really good reviews. There's a couple other things I want to try too, but we will have to see how that works out. It just depends on what kind of money situation I'm in and where I'm going. I have, what was that I was going to say? Well, I had other things I wanted to say, but I can't think of it right now. And not editing your videos. That kind of gives you a little bit of, of trouble when it comes to that. But yeah. So I might end up not posting this video at all. I don't know. I feel like I'm being super duper awkward and I don't know if I can post this. But if you guys, if I did post this and you liked it, thank you. Thank you so much. I don't know if I'll be able to reshoot this video again because like I said, I like to do the authentic reactions to things because that to me is much more interesting and I want to keep doing that kind of thing. I don't want it to be like fake and staged and not genuine at all so yeah that's what my deal is so if this doesn't get posted or if it does get posted and you're wondering why i'm so awkward that that's that's not normal it's just i've been doing this thing where i either post or i don't post and if i like the video i post it if i don't like it it doesn't get posted so that's that but anyhow i better wrap this up i have like maybe 15 20 minutes before i need to be back at my desk and back on the phone i want to thank everybody one more time for being here if you like this video click the like button down below the little thumbs up that helps a lot share with your friends if you think there's anything in here that one of your friends would appreciate and subscribe please subscribe i'm trying to get my subscribers up if i get my subscribers up the more, the better that I do on YouTube, the more that I can give back to you all because you're the reason that I'm here. 
I could have just done these videos just for myself and never made them public, which was something that I did toy with the idea of, but I wanted it to be fun. And I wanted my mom and my sisters who are not here in North Carolina with me to be able to have something of me and my family near them always and that they could reference and then I thought it might be fun for other people too because there's a lot of people who have the same interests as I do. I've got a blog that I'm get start I'm starting on getting going and I've probably a web page that'll be up in some time. I'm not sure when I'm still working on it. And there's a lot coming in the future and just stick around and thank you so much. Like, share, subscribe. Thank you for your time. Have a great day. I know I've babbled for 20 minutes. Thank you for being here. Thank you so much. Peace out, homies. Bye-bye.